Hi, this is Dr. Inge Parrick. Welcome to Whiteboard Wednesdays. We're going to talk about cleaning out the carotid artery and what that means. So I get asked a lot of questions about, you know, what does it mean to clean out a carotid artery? There are three different ways we, we've we talked about this in other Whiteboard Wednesday topics that you can click on. There is a way of opening it up, which is carotid endorectomy or CEA, where we go in and scoop out all the plaque. There's a way where we go in from base of the neck and we fracture or kind of bust the plaque. All of that plaque gets sucked out of the body along with blood, gets filtered and then given back. And then we line stent in its place, which is called TCAR or transcarotid artery revascularization. And then there's a method of transfemoral artery carotid stenting, which is going from the groin or the arm and going up to the carotid artery and then putting a stent and ballooning it open. So there are three big methods of fixing your carotid artery with our current technologies. If you take all of these patients who got carotid artery surgeries in one manner or another, and you scan their brain with MRI, sometimes you see this little tiny flex of something that must have broken off and gone to the brain. And they look like these little tiny little white spots on the MRI. And if you trend the patients and take those patients that have tiny little specks or dots in your brain MRI after a carotid intervention, the more specks you have, the more likely you have dementia later on in life. So even if we're not quite catching what's happening in terms of stroke just from doing the procedure right now, all of this has implication that it may build up and create significant outcomes of aka dementia later on in life. So because of this, it's it gets very tricky when it comes to cleaning out your carotid arteries. We do need to be able to know which one is going to be the best for you. And there has been now multiple published articles that say if your surgeon knows how to do all three things and your, if your hospital can provide all three of these things, then the patient outcome is much better as an institution as a whole, which means you want to go talk to somebody who can counsel you in all three different possible surgeries, which myself and all of my partners are able to do all of these thir three surgeries, and I'm very comfortable with that, so that we can pick out the best way to clean out your carotid arteries so that we protect you now, as well as protecting you 10 years from now. And thank you for joining me on carotid artery surgery and how to best clean this out without causing you any issues. Issues. See you next time.